Stormtrooper Environmental Society and Chibok Suzuki Foundation put on a rally, Save Our Seafood Chowder, Defend Our Communities, on Saturday. About a hundred people showed up across from Outland Terminal to protest expanding tar sand development. The point of the, today's rally is to let people across Canada know that we're determined to keep oil tankers out of our waters to defend our coast. The peaceful rally included speeches and free seafood chowder to those in attendance. We eat a lot of uh, seafood chowder in Prince Rupert. We're, we're so connected to the ocean here and, and the clean food. We have crabs, we have halibut. The Skeena River has two million sockeye salmon returning on average every year. It's, a, it's why the city's here partly, is, is the fishery. So and that's what's endangered by these oil tanks. The event took place near Atlan Terminal, where the Port of Prince Rupert's office is located. The yeah, Port of Prince Rupert is planning to have oil tankers loading in, right in Prince Rupert Harbour, right at the mouth of the Skeena River. And um, I've seen plans for uh, 100 Afromax oil tankers loading in 2015. That was their estimate for um, a risk assessment. Prince Rupert's event was one of many around Canada on November 16th, which was Defend Our Climate, Defend Our Communities Day of Action. For the Northernview.com, I'm Martina Perry.